If you guys are looking to buy or sell your college football 25 ultimate team coins, go over to AOEAH.com. They do all your coin business on there, boys. And using code Monty will get you 3% off of your order. Go over to AOEAH to buy or sell your coins, boys. What is going on, YouTube? And welcome back to another CFB 25 ultimate team video, man. You guys can see what we are looking at. We are looking at the season one field pass, man. And why are we looking at the season one field pass to help you guys level up man i'm gonna show you guys the best and the most fast way to level up in this game right now and i'm obviously just gonna be showing you guys all of the objectives but doing what i am going to say exactly is the fastest way to level up in this game and honestly boys it is super super easy so before we get into this video you guys know what to do man subscribe smash that like button and turn on that noti bell and join the noti gang let's get into this video so we have all of these promos we have the icymy mi i always say my it is mi we have the ultimate alumni we have the conference stories and of course we have the legends so what do all of these uh promos have in common with each other and that is that you need to put these players in your lineup to earn the xp from the objectives so put two conference stories players in your lineup doesn't matter what overall doesn't have to be a starter you don't have to get the 30 tackles with those players you just gotta get 30 tackles same goes for the ultimate alumni put two ultimate alumni players in your lineup and win games force fumbles the icymi put two of those in your lineup as well and legends only you only need to put one legends in there which is pretty cool so only one legends player so make sure you guys have legends conference stories ultimate alumni and icymi make sure you have two of those players each in your lineup legends you only need one so boys once you do all of that what should you be doing and that is solo seasons now i would usually say solo battles but obviously solo battles is not even in the game but solo seasons is low-key even better if you really think about it you get better rewards you get packs and coins along the way so solo seasons is low-key the best one all american solo seasons so boys that is what you want to be playing it is pretty much solo battles very very similar you know it is really easy it is not hard at all so you can get all of these done on solo seasons guys you guys can see i'm level 40 i did obviously get the xp glitch so that is a reason i am a high level but i mean you guys can see i got all of these done all these objectives are literally done except for these two right here and they are also almost done you know uh four more tackles like light work and like 450 more yards rushing that's light so you guys can see i got these done literally just by playing the game like i said man solo seasons it, it, you're gonna get this done way more quick in any other mode in in solo seasons than any other mode you, you guys get what i'm saying like make sure you do it on the solo seasons if you have not played your much or your cut champs yet i would go ahead and maybe do it even do it on that it's not a bad idea because um you definitely want to play your champs weekly boys champs is something i'm gonna tell you guys to get done weekly it is a main coin source in this game is playing champs so make sure you guys are playing that weekly but yeah man solo seasons definitely the best way i mean there's really not much else to say guys you put it on it you know it's super easy and you just get stats and wins done as you play the game all i'm gonna say is is make sure you put these players in your lineup and that's it i mean there, there's not much else to say guys it is it's you know it is that simple like i would tell you like what to do to get certain stuff done but you don't really need to man if you guys have any questions let me know in the comment section below like ways to get interceptions or fumbles or sacks but if i'm being real with you man all of that should be pretty easy it should just come by easily because the opponent is not that good now interceptions i you know i'm not gonna say that interceptions come by easily because if i'm being honest i don't really remember if they come by easily in that game mode but i know like sacks and fumbles like that is something that it, it, you're just it's just gonna randomly happen in the middle of the game like you'll see it like it's gonna happen not nor not like normally but it'll happen every here and there during the game but guys that is like pretty much it for the the best way to level up in cut right now man that is it put these guys in your lineup play some solo seasons or really any game mode but i would if you really want to level up solo seasons boys and that's it uh for the rest of this video man i don't really know we'll just look around they added those the added the new objectives the season one wins 
I don't know what else they added. I know they added this one right here. So if you have not, if you have been completing your challenges and you're like, oh, well, they didn't add anything new recently. They added this one right here. This is a new objective, I believe. Either it's either this one or it's this one. It might just be win games. I believe it's this one right here. And they also added, I want to say it was this one right here, the tackles. Or actually, no, it was the conference stories. It was this one for the conference stories, the tackles for the conference stories. So those are the new challenges they added, boys. And uh, hop on it, man. Hop on it, man. I am level 40. I am moving. I am moving, man. There's only 10 more levels to get, pretty much. Really, 11. And this 87 comes towards the end of it. You get this 84 BND, the team pack, another 84 auctionable. I mean, it, it is just valid, man. It is just valid. They should have added a... They should have made this a, a rare BND fancy pack, but whatever. If you guys did enjoy this video, man, smash that like button. Subscribe if you are new. Love you, boys. That is pretty much it for this video. I mean, I really don't know what else. Like I said, boys, see, leveling up is not a hard concept. It is super, super easy, man. And another thing I'm going to say is, is make sure you're getting your daily objectives done every single day. A free 900 XP every single day is a lot more than you think. I mean, you guys can see to get to level 41, you, I need about 3,000 more. In three days, I will literally get, I have four days actually for this, for this one. But in four days, guys, I will literally level up just from completing daily objectives to level 41. Now, I know that four days is a lot. But this is level 41, guys. You know, in the start of the field pass, you probably level up super easy off of daily objectives. But guys, that is pretty much it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Peace out.